Wednesday everyone Gina here and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you guys are new here so we have another grocery haul this week so I went back to Albertsons I haven't been to Trader Joe's in about two weeks uh, because I've been just going to Albertsons that might change next week I don't know there's no specific rules with my groceries as long as I get it in budget at least that's what my husband wants to hear from me so um, I'm gonna hop into everything so we are a family of six I have four kids it's my husband myself and we also have two dogs I am on a dairy-free gluten-free poultry-free diet and my husband kind of just eats whatever I make him he has some specifics but um, for the most part I try to incorporate meals that everyone can eat so this week I spent a total of $216 and I got $2.50 back from Fetch Rewards. So I didn't get a bunch back from rebates. Um, there were some digital coupons. I am in Southern California. So I'm in Southern California. So if you have a Safeway affiliate, um, maybe these prices will be similar. Maybe they won't, but I'm gonna hop into the haul. So first thing I picked up for the kids are these bomb pops. So self-explanatory, pick these up. My kids love popsicles in the summer. I also got two things of Eggo waffles. So I got the emoji variety and I also got the chocolate chip ones, which is in another bag somewhere. I also picked up two things of the Open Nature grass-fed beef. These were on sale for $6.99, I think. And I had um, a seven off meat purchase coupon. I save up my rewards to get to that $7 off meat purchase. Uh, so I was able to take $7 off of a meat purchase. I also got some crinkle fries. And I got a repurchase of the Silk Dairy Free Almond Creamer. And honestly, you guys, I'm not missing my other creamers. This one is totally fine. I didn't don't even really notice the difference. I also got a big bag of broccoli florets. So I have been loving like broccoli salad. So I've kind of switched from kale and spinach and I'm kind of doing like a broccoli chopped salad. I add some quinoa to it. I'll add some uh, sunflower seeds. I'll add some craisins. I'll add avocado. It comes out delicious. So pick that up. I also picked up uh, two of the pre-cut peppers and onion slices. I love doing I like fajita veggies with this. So I like making, this is like a side salad. I just add some uh, minced garlic to it, some salt and pepper, and I'll serve this as a side dish for my husband and I, or I'll do kind of like a taco salad with the broccoli and the bell peppers and onions, and it comes out great. I also picked up some of the Mission 25 calorie tortillas. My husband absolutely loves these. I also picked up some thin, pastrami from Hillshire Farms. Uh, pastrami is my favorite deli meat. So I also picked up some of these mild Italian sausages. They were on sale for $4.99 again. So what I like to do is I'll do the sausages paired with the bell peppers and onions. So this makes for a really good meal. If you don't want to do brown rice, you can do quinoa. I have some leftover quinoa in the fridge still. I also picked up a bag of baby carrots. So I told the kids to pick out two vegetables they will eat this week. So my son Sawyer, he picked out carrots. So I got him carrots. I think my favorite section in Albertsons is the reduced bakery section. So one, my son absolutely loves blueberry muffins. So this is regularly $5, but it was in the reduced section for 99 cents. And my son's gonna plow through these probably in the next two days. So great find there. And you can also freeze them as well. So I got two gallons of milk because I have two growing girls in the house. I also got a nice little deal on Cheez-It Snaps. So I picked this flavor up. It is the double cheese and I got another one somewhere. I'll show it to you, but they're on sale for $1.99 and there is a digital coupon to take $2 off of two. So it makes these bags 99 cents after the digital coupon, which I thought was good. So my husband, he loves the 70 calorie bread. So I got him the oral wheat. These were on sale for $4.99. I only buy him the Dave's when it's on sale. We also got some bananas and strawberries are on a really good deal. Strawberries are $1.97 limit of four. So I picked four of these up. Only have two in the bag right now. 
Alrighty, so next up, there was a deal on Kellogg's products. So uh, the box Pop-Tarts are $1.99 along with the Kellogg's cereals when you buy three. So I got the kids brown sugar and I also got them strawberry. They absolutely love Pop-Tarts. I also got a thing of mac and cheese. This is the whole grain mac and cheese. These were $1.99. Scarlett is approving. I have to buy a ton of lactose-free milk, so I got four of these. And two more things of strawberries. So I got four total because I think that's a great deal. And I've been adding the strawberries to my water and it's absolutely delicious, you guys. So if you haven't put strawberries in your water, this is your sign to go ahead and start. Alrighty, so next up, I got these for my son Tanner. These are these mini chocolate chip cookies from Tate's. They're 10 for 10 or a dollar a piece. So I got these for my son Tanner. He's looking over at me. Um, another 99 cent bakery find are these croissants. I thought this would be good. And like a switch from the normal peanut butter and jelly. I thought maybe doing peanut butter and jelly in a croissant or just pairing this on the side with dinner, add some butter to it. Scarlet's approving. I also found this in the reduced section. It's 99 cents. And what is this? This is sticky buns, a five count. So I'm headed to my parents' house on Friday. So I thought that would be a nice thing to offer them. All right, so this was the second bag of Cheez-Its I got. I got the white cheddar flavor. I also got a thing of Nature Own Perfectly Crafted Bread. This is the white bread. I also got two dozen eggs. We needed a total of 24 eggs, so I went ahead and got two dozen eggs. So also $1.99 are the Keebler cookies, a variety of them. So I went ahead and just got the kids some um, M&M cookies for, you know, after dinner treats. You could even make little ice cream sandwiches with these guys. You use two cookies and put some ice cream in the middle. It could be a really fun ice cream sandwich for the kids. My son Tanner is very specific with his pasta and I've learned from him that he only likes spaghetti pasta. He doesn't like penne. He doesn't like any of the other pastas. It has to be spaghetti pasta. So got him spaghetti pasta. <laughs> so next up, my daughter requested frosted flakes. So I refilled her frosted flakes. All right. So I also picked up the Enjoy Life chocolate chips, the dark chocolate morsels. Uh, Dairy-free, gluten-free, vegan. So these are expensive, but I buy them anyways. It's a nice little sweet treat, especially adding in yogurts or melting it and doing the fig. I absolutely love doing the dates with the melted chocolate and peanut butter in the middle, and then you stick it in the freezer, and it is so good, you guys. All right, so this was a nice freebie. It's the Temptations Puree. So these are gonna go to Mimo and Papa's cat. Uh, it's four pouches of purees and this is the tuna flavor. So, um, it's free after you submit to Fetch Rewards. I also found this for the kids cause I need to keep the snacks going with them cause they're hungry all day long. So this is the Annie's organic cheddar snack mix. So it comes with, um, the Annie's crackers, the little breadsticks, and it also comes with pretzels. So I thought they would enjoy that. My son requested more fruit snacks. They didn't have minion fruit snacks, sorry bud. Uh, but I got the Welch's, they were on sale for $2.99. My husband's very specific with his oatmeal. If you guys have seen my grocery hauls, you will know my husband is very specific with his oatmeal. Um, and I had to get him cinnamon spice. He told me I can go ahead and get him regular brown sugar, which I'll get at Target because it's significantly cheaper. I cringe every week. $6.49 for powdered vanilla creamer. Are you kidding me? Sugar-free. $6.49, but he uses it every day, so it's fine. All right, to go with uh, Mr. Tanner's spaghetti, I got some marinara sauce. All right, so we also got two more things of lactose-free milk. I got four total. So I also got Scarlett's request. She said she would eat green beans and she said she would eat corn. Sawyer also said he'd eat corn. So I just went with the canned version. And then I also got some diced tomatoes with onion, celery, and green peppers. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this with the 
uh, sausages I got and add this into it and then serve it on top of quinoa and brown rice. And I think that would be a really good dinner. All right, so in this bag, we have more bananas and 14 MV apples because we love MV apples in this house. So had to refill the MV apples. All right, so I already mentioned I got chocolate chip waffles, so I got these. I also got some Colby Jack cheese sticks. Another thing of milk. I also got some silk yogurt. So these are the dairy-free, gluten-free yogurt. So I got three of them. They're on sale for $1.99. And there is a $1.25 off digital coupon when you buy three. So I got a strawberry one, a vanilla one, and another strawberry one. And it's really good for like a little dessert to sprinkle some of those uh, chocolate chips that I showed earlier. Really good. So we also needed a refill on ketchup because Scarlett said she'd eat corn, but she has to have a little ketchup on it. So got her that. Yeah. And I got two ice creams. So I got the enlightened brownie and cookie dough and the mint chocolate chip. They're buy one, get one free, and there's a dollar digital. So it makes both of them $4.99, which I thought was a good price. You're gonna see ice cream deals all over the place. So make sure you're looking out for ice cream deals at your local grocery stores. All right, so I got two different rice cakes for myself. So I got the cinnamon toast one for a nice little dessert, put a little bit of natural peanut butter on it, put some craisins on it even, or there's so many things you can do with rice cakes. I also got the um, brown rice lightly salted. So what I like to do is put uh, pastrami on this and then put some mustard on top. And it's a nice little hack for sandwiches. So I also picked up some popcorn shrimp. And I got three things of watermelon. So these were three for 12 or $4 a piece. So I went ahead and got three of them. And I think that concludes my grocery haul. That is everything I picked up for my family of six plus two dogs. So I guess we're a household of eight. As you can see, I try to have a healthy balance of snacks and fun things for the kids, but also healthy, wholesome items for them as well. So I hope you guys are all having a fantastic Wednesday with whatever it is you were doing. Make sure you like this video so I know you have enjoyed it. Click that follow button if you're following me here over on TikTok, and I will talk to you guys all very, very soon. Bye, guys.